He's having a seizure. He will survive. A strong subject. There. He's opening his eyes. He saved him, Fuller. I... I can't get up. Don't move, Pierce. You can certainly say that you gave us a scare. <laughs> what did you do to me? Undo these straps! Whoa! Go easy, my friend. You were dead. He killed you. Are you sure he's better? He was... He was dead. Me too! We, we were dead! What are you doing? I'm sorry, my friend. <laughs> No! What happened to me? Where am I? Mr. Sanders, you have to come with us. No, please. I can't leave here. You've got no choice, Sanders, and neither do we. You don't understand. If I go out, he'll see me. No, no! You're leaving this cell. Please. I don't want him to find me.
dust on the horizon. You will choose. I will not be here to bear witness to it, because you will have released me. But the earth will resound to your cries. You there. Wake up. Come on, stand up. We don't have much time. Can you stand up? Who are you? A friend of Ethan Bradley. It was he who told me that you had been interned here. Wait. Bradley is really alive? I don't understand. You filled me... So full of drugs, I can't distinguish dream from reality. Please believe that I have nothing to do with these disgraceful treatments. Look, I don't have time to explain everything. I'm not really supposed to be here. And the same goes for you, according to Ethan. You must leave as soon as possible, and as unobtrusively as possible. I've brought you your clothes. Let me go ahead. We'll meet upstairs. Uh, wait a minute. What's going on here? What do they do to the patients to make them so terrified? I would really like to know. I only see them when they are brought up for medical treatment, for problems they didn't have before going downstairs. But this is neither the time nor the place to talk about that. We must not stay here. There are two men standing guard near the stairs. It's the only way to the floor above. I shall try to distract them and get at least one to come with me. All you need to do is to follow me as soon as the way is free. Understood.
What does this mean? What did they inject him with? Sarah Hawkins is on this list of authorized visitors. Why the strange symbol repeated over and over? Sarah. Am I in an asylum? What did he write about the painting? If I don't get out of here, I'll end up like him. Dr. Corden, I would like to say that I'm surprised to see you, but we all know that your curiosity will be your ruin. I don't understand. These people need care. You keep them in this terrible place as if... Go back upstairs where your patients are waiting for you to treat them. As for you, gentlemen, do not disappoint me anymore. No one enters or leaves. Yes, Doctor. I'll have to find a way of getting rid of those two myself. I told you not to let her come down. I know. And if you do it again, I'll report you. All right. I know.
The machine is working again, but the control wheels haven't been put back on. I was just going to the storage room. I can bring them to you. No, Dr. Fuller doesn't want us touching the pressure valves. As you want. I'm gonna see if there are sleeping pills left. They run out again upstairs. Put a few aside for me, will ya? And above all, leave the wheels where they are. You. Yeah, you there. Come here. 
I don't know what you're doing there, but you don't seem to be friends with the nurses. I can help you. Help me, and I'll owe you one. You. Yeah, you there. Come here. What do you want? Sleep. That's all. Sleep? You don't want to leave? No. Have you seen the storm that's brewing? I'm fine here. Except for one problem. You want sleeping pills, right? Yeah. And in exchange, I can make noise. Lots of noise. You'll draw the guards to your cell to allow me to escape. So, you in? Find something to make me sleep, and I'll take care of the guards for you. Is it the noise that disturbs you? No, it's the nightmares. We all have them here. That's what wakes us up. And afterwards, there's no way to get back to sleep. I'll find you some pills. Go look in the storage room. There must be sleeping pills there. What is well enough inside me? I feel it in my head and in my body. Enters me. Yes, 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 yes. If I walk, I do not stop. If I do not stop, he does not catch me. If he does not catch me, I do not sleep. If I do not sleep, I do not see him. I do not hear him. He does not call. He does not call. Oh, again. We must not eat it. They must know that it is not good. Anatomy, anthropology, nothing surprising. Dementia, self-inflicted wounds. Sarah Hawkins, she was a patient here. Zoology, esotericism, mineralogy, and a full shelf on cephalopods.
Good God. What could this machine be used for? The corpse is complete. Whose are these limbs? Is there a connection between this corpse and the machine? This machine seems to consume a great deal of electricity. Worse and worse. What's the connection between this meat and the electrical installation? Vats of rotten flesh? An elaborate electrical system? Like a dumb pulp novel. Cops know what's going on? I can still increase the load. The 
it's an ammeter. I didn't expect to see one on this little rock. Have I activated anything? What will happen if I increase the current to the limit? I can still increase the load. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs>